A North Central Florida senator sat down with TV20 to tell us about the bills impacting Gainesville that were passed during the legislative session. TV20's Alexis Goings tells us why Senator Keith Perry says this was the busiest session of his career. Senator Keith Perry of Gainesville spoke to TV20 about the bills passed statewide and locally. Some statewide bills regard immigration, gun laws, prescription drug prices, abortion, and LGBTQ plus education issues. But locally, a bill passed by the legislature and sponsored by Perry and Representative Chuck Clemens of Newberry would take control of GRU out of the hands of the Gainesville City Commission. GRU currently has $1.7 billion in debt, $375 million of which are for the biomass plant. These, this is probably the most fiscal, irresponsible uh, transaction that's taken place in the state of Florida that I've ever heard about. Mm -hmm. And it happened right here, and it happened under a group of, of city commissioners and mayors that had zero desire or even comprehension of fiscal side of it. Perry says the governor appointed board will not own GRU, but serve as a board of directors. Perry also discussed funds allocated for a STEM school located in Gainesville, which he hopes can open by fall of 2024. 13 years up there, this is by far the busiest. We passed more legislation. The budget was the biggest by far, um, and that's a, a testament. We had a $117 billion budget. Wow. When I first got in office in 2010, we had a budget of $73 billion. The governor has the power to veto items in the budget and the local bills. In the studio, Alexis Goings, TV 20 News.